Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to my gaming lair. So this area up here, it's on the second floor. This is my studio, gaming, whatever. This is supposed to be my all-encompassing area. So, some of you guys know that I've moved twice at the end of 2018. And in the last two years, I've moved a total of three times. So I haven't been here that long. Um, I still have boxes I haven't unpacked. Obviously, I don't have anything up here other than some of my equipment. And I wanted to make this area here where I'm at uh, like a like a little studio, you know, where I could make make like a set, make videos right here. But if you can hear, I don't know if you can tell out here, hello, hello, it totally echoes. So it just goes out toward the front door and down to the first floor and it's an echo chamber. I hung some, uh, some packing blankets, which I'll show you, camouflage packing blankets to try and cut down on it, but out here it's really bad. Behind me, I've got a room here on the left, the darker room is, that's Buck's room and my, my, like my storage area. And then the brighter room, that's my actual gaming room. There's the front door down there. Probably can't see it, but this area here is wildly echoey. So I put up these packing blankets there and here, and it, it didn't really help. Got some of my lighting and stuff over here, my tripods, just basic storage. And then here, this is Buck's room and oh, look who's in there. Hey buddy, Bucky. Bucky sleepy, he likes to sleep and he likes to eat. It's hard to focus on that. But in here I just got, you know, storage. There's some of my acoustic panels and things like that. He's got his doubled up pink bed there that was on sale. Then we got that bed there for him at Costco. So he likes sleeping in here when I'm working in my room. But quickly I'll show you. That's the other side. You can see the light I was using because the light in here is terrible. I've got acoustic panels and some stuff marks on the wall where I'm looking to hang the stuff. But that's it there. Got a little closet here and I got a little bathroom here, right? No biggie, but it makes it nice to not have to walk very far to get to the bathroom. All right, so we got Buck's room. We got my gaming office here. So here's what we got, you guys. And if you can hear as they come in here, the acoustics, how it changes. So that orange panel on the wall is an acoustic panel. That green panel back there is an acoustic bass trap panel. That blue panel on the wall there is an acoustic panel. And it's also carpeted in here where it's not out here. It's not carpeted. It's uh, some fake tile wood looking stuff. Anyway. So on my wall here, I got my giant meaty from Minecraft stomping out the uh, creeper as usual. Got some uh, Marvel stuff on the wall and my Juggernog right here. I really like my Juggernog machine. That thing's awesome. And then some collectibles. You know, I've got some of those uh, Pop Toys and Funko or whatever they're called. I got some Fallout stuff. I've got Minecraft stuff. I've got some custom made stuff that some people have made for me. I got my Fallout Pip Boy down there, my bigger Fallout guy, and a big bullet. So I got all, you know, just fun stuff. It's just fun stuff. I keep some of my camera gear over there. There's my PlayStation, my mixer. Uh, my chair is demoed, you guys. Look at this thing. It's all ripped and torn, but that's what happens when, you, when you're heavy and you sit in it too much. So here's my basic setup, you guys. I've got a computer under there. That's my main computer. I got a computer under there. Hey, what are you doing? You hungry? You want some ham? You want some ham? You want some pretzels? What about cheese? You like cheese? Huh? You want some cheese? You like cheese? He does, he loves cheese and he loves stick pretzels. But you're not supposed to eat that stuff, dude. You're supposed to eat dog food. Hey, dog food, you hungry? What, you gonna go outside? You gonna go outside? Huh, what's up? Do you have to go to the bathroom? Do you have to go to the bathroom? Or do you just want food? What? You gotta learn to talk, dude. I don't know what you're saying. Food? Pretzels. Ham? What do you want? 
What do you want, buddy? Bucky, huh? You go outside? Do you want to go outside? Do you want to go outside? Is that a yes? Stomp twice for yes. Do you want to go outside? Do you want to eat food when I'm eating? Oh, that's what it is. Hey, I'm in the middle of something, bud. I'll be with you in a second. Do not go to the bathroom in the house if that's what you're needing. Huh? You wanna play some games? You wanna play a video game? Do you wanna play a video game? Yeah? You want some ham in video game? What? 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 What are you doing? What? You like the camera? Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, don't bite the camera. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, Buck. Oh, Buck. Knock something over. Come on. Knock it over. Come on. Do you know, you get too excited, you're gonna jump down those stairs. Get away from the camera. Come on. Oh, you're trying to punch me now, huh, buddy? All right, back in here. So my setup is a two PC setup, but I stream from a single PC. So my main monitor here, that's my second monitor off my main computer. So I run my recording program here, my game here. Over here, I, I run a copy of the live stream and like donations and stuff. And then this vertical monitor here is all for the chat. It's all for the chat. So I can see a full length of chat. Makes it a lot easier. And I got my, my big light here for when I, I do stuff and I sit in my chair. You can see it lights up really nice. And it's pretty basic. I mean, I got the essentials in the, in the closet there. I got some water and some red cups and some Advil. I don't know what else you need. There might be a Glock 19 in there, but... And the dreaded window. I need to do something with that because I get sun in my face. So that's a, that's a quick peek at my gaming setup. Uh, it's, you know, there's nothing special about it and it doesn't need to be anything special. What it needs to be is comfortable and fun and functional, that's the key to it, is functional. You know, I like the colorful stuff in the background. It looks good on the camera behind me, and it's just, it's fun to collect little things like that. As far as this goes, you know, I've had these two monitors here for probably five or six years or more. This one I've had for four years. This one I got for a hundred bucks. It looks like, oh my God, you got to, and I do have a monitor behind this one on a swing arm. These are all on swing arms. I can swing this out of the way, swing the other one forward, and then that's my PlayStation monitor. I never did that before. I always just would change the inputs on the main one. But if I was streaming the PlayStation, it was harder to do that because I, I needed access to the main monitor. But this setup works really good. I can look to the right. I can make sure my, my stream is working and my, my donations and all of that stuff here. And then big as day, the chat. That's why it's... That's why I interact with the chat so much because I keep it, I dedicate that whole monitor in vertical form to the chat. And I think it works really good. It works really, really good. I just bought a little whiteboard today to put over there because I make a lot of little notes. Not a lot, I make notes and I end up throwing them away. So on the whiteboard, maybe I could do a, like a to-do list or maybe if I get some, some ideas, I can just jot them up there and you know, brainstorm with them, stuff like that. But when I, when I set up for like uh, yesterday's video, the little vlog video, I set my camera right over here and I shoot this way with this in the background because that's why I have my big light right here. Right now the lighting's not good because I'm set up from the doorway, but it's really just to give you an idea of what this is, what this is all about. So this, what I have you guys is a collection of, of over more than 10 years worth of, a lot, a lot longer than 10 years. So. You know, if, if you're looking at something going, oh my God, I wish I could have that. Well, it just takes time. It takes time to build up stuff. Never throw away any monitors. I mean, you're a monitor reading chat or something like that. You don't even need to be that good. You just need to be able to see it. It's not like your primary gaming monitor. That's a Predator that came out a few years ago. It's a 1440p, but I run it in 1080 because that's what I record in. So it, it all works out. 
it all works out and it's very comfortable. It's big enough and I was able to get my desk far enough away from the wall where I can walk in behind. I can open and close my window. I can put lights up behind there if I need to. And that's why the desk is kind of sitting in the middle of the room. Anyway, you guys, that's it for this one. I wanted to give you a sneak peek into the gaming setup at this location. I don't even think I did one at my temporary location. I was here when I first moved to Arizona, but this is the, the permanent one, but it is like about 20% work in progress. That's about as far as I've gotten. Same thing with my garage. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. Hit that like button. If you're subscribed, hit the bell notifications, leave me a comment. I'll see you guys next time.